you guys doing today? Good. Okay, I'm going to need some more excitement. I know it's lunchtime, but how are you guys doing today? Good. All right, all right, all right. So I'm Dr. Mike McGee. I'm the chief of the emergency department at Methodist Hospital, both campuses. I'm also the medical director of EMS uh, and the medical director of the ER department, as well as the medical director of the Indiana University Student Health Center. We're here today because of our program. You guys are aware of POP on Youth Violence, which means Project Outreach and Prevention. Yes. You guys have seen us out in the community talking to students about the inherent epidemic of violence. Yes. But in addition to doing that, we also have a wonderful mentoring program and a program called HPEP, which is a program to get minority students into medical school or dental school or a nurse practitioner school or physician's assistant school. And so this program, which means Health Professions Enrichment Program, was designed by myself and Dr. Rutland to increase the number of minority students in basically high school, juniors or seniors, but we do have some brilliant sophomores and freshmen here, to go into medical school or the, uh, the health professions. And so what we've done, this is our third year, and we're here at IU. We have a partnership with several different uh, entities. Uh, Indiana University Northwest, as well as Purdue Calumet, as well as the Community Health Net, which is a federally qualified healthcare center, and Methodist. So you guys have had your second day, and so the first day, we had an outstanding agenda for you. You guys were able to hear myself and Dr. Rutman talk about medicine. We talked about why we went into medicine. We talked about things that you guys need to do to get into medicine. And we had different other people from IU come and talk to you about the admissions process. You guys met Dr. Bankston, who's the dean of the medical school. And it's been fabulous, right? Yes. Yeah. All right. And so today, what do we do today? CPR. Right? What do we do today? CPR. CPR? Panel. Okay, tell us about that student oh. panel. <laughs> tell us about that student panel. The student panel was um, students from IU and that either graduated, undergraduate. Um, we had one that in medical school currently and a couple that's going to medical school that have applied and they just told us different things that we should know about the medical the medical schooling like application process and things we should know about being an undergraduate and how we should transition from high school <coughs> excuse me from high school to college that's, that's, and as a matter of fact that medical school panel is still here so I'm going to have you stand up and tell who you are, starting with you on the, on, the, on the right. Just tell who you are briefly and what you're going to go into. And go right down the line doing the same thing. So my name is Bree Degree. I'm a sophomore at IUN. I'm majoring in biology and minoring in chemistry and business administration. Hi, my name is Simon Jackson. I'm a senior and I'm going to medical school. I'm going to be applying. And I'm a psych major with a triple minor in physics, chemistry, and biology. Hello, my name is Chimar Kute. I am a recent graduate here from IU Northwest with a biology degree and a minor in chemistry and psychology, and I'm currently applying to medical school. Hello, I'm Devin Williams. Uh, I graduated from IU Northwest two years ago with a uh, bachelor's in biology. Uh, currently in my second year of medical school uh, with an interest in emergency medicine. And also, what else? What other program were you involved with? Also heavily involved in uh, POP. Uh, with Dr. McGee for the past few years um, and every other program that he's asked me to help him out with. <laughs> All right, I'm John Terrell. I spoke with uh, a good percentage of you guys, uh, second year at the University of Virginia, uh, major in global public health and minor in media studies as well. And you're going to school to do what? Going to school to be a doc. Right. <laughs> and also, John Terrell, I uh, wanted to, want to tell me about your, your, uh, you being the president of SAVE at your school. Oh, yeah, so I was just uh, president of the SAFE chapter, uh, Students Against Violence Everywhere, so we just tried to put on different programs and uh, initiatives to uh, kind of get Dr. McGee and other speakers out to speak to our students um, at 21st Century Charter School um, and, you know, just try to make them more aware of the things that's going on in the community uh, and, 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 and their surroundings and how they can be a big impact on, you know, making any type of difference uh, possible. So, thank you. Yes. My name is Magdalena Barajas. Uh, I'm a senior here now at Indiana University of Northwest. I'm majoring in biology with minors in chemistry, Spanish, and business administration. And I'll be graduating in a year. Congrats. Yes. My name is uh, Dominic Kowalczyk. 
Um, I'm a student here at the <laughs> University of Northwest studying biology. Um, I'm going to be a senior this year, and I am applying to medical school this cycle. My name is Jessica Rico. I just recently graduated with my bachelor's of science in biology and minor in chemistry, and I'm currently applying to dental school. Okay, guys, just for the camera, I'm going to ask all of you to raise your hand for the careers you plan on going into. Um, raise your hand for everybody who wants to be a physician in the audience. Raise your hand for everybody who wants to be a physician, a doctor. Raise your hand for everybody who wants to be a doctor. I, I know the other day I had like maybe 12 of you guys, so now it's down to three, four, five. Raise your hand high. Okay, guys, remember we said you got to speak up for what you want. All right? Wow, the numbers seem to have dwindled from the other day. I'm going to have to fact check on my notes. All right. Are you guys getting scared now? We're giving you too much information. It's overwhelming. Everybody wants to be a nurse. Raise your hand. OK. 